What is up guys, George right here. Today we're talking about how you can fix the boot loop created by iOS 9.1 jailbreak provided by Pangu team. You probably know it's been on Reddit on a jailbreak Reddit page. Someone uh, started a overheated discussion about this bug that renders your device unusable after you jailbreak iOS 9.1 with Pangu, but it actually has a fix and we're going to um, to see in a few seconds what is the fix, but first of all, let's see the jailbreaking um, discussion right here. As you can see, Xprix, probably, uh, started the discussion saying that don't jailbreak 9.1 at the moment, it's non-fixable bootloop. So yeah, if you already jailbroke, jailbroken 9.1, I would update to 9.2.1 or don't let the phone battery die or reboot the device because this can cause a kernel panic and your iPhone will not be able to recover again. Uh, Yonic confirmed it's not recoverable bootloop, so if you don't want to buy a new iPhone, stay away until they patch that. Actually, I don't really think it's possible to break completely a device just by creating a kernel panic, because kernel panics can't affect DFU as um, this guy right here state. That you will lose your jailbreak and your data, but not your device. Uh, restoring should work on items. But um, actually, this is a fake uh, bootloop. It's just a um, the phone acting like it's uh, in a bootloop. So if you try multiple times to reboot your device, even if it's stuck on the Apple logo, it will actually uh, start normally. And if you get to start it normally, or if you don't have this issue yet, what you need to do in order to fix or to avoid this issue is of course to install something from Cydia. And what you need to do is to, first of all, go to Cydia. After that, you click right here on the search and you will write in the search bar Pangu and you will see three different things. Pangu 7.1.1 or 7.1.x and Tether, you will not install that. Pangu 8.0, 8.1.x on Tether, you're not going to install that either. And Pangu 9.0.x on Tether, and this is what you need to install. You will click it, and you will be brought to this page, which is the version 1.3, do not downgrade. And you will click modify. As you can see, it's compatible with 9.12 right here. And if you click modify, you'll get this little thing right here and you click install. If you click downgrade, you will get to install a, an older version that might not support iOS 9.1. So you have to click install and you have to confirm by, by uh, clicking here, continue quoting. And of course you will get to install it and you can reboot your phone and so on. You are done. So what you need to search again, it's Pangu 9.0.x and Tether, and it's this one right here. And the version is 1.3. This will actually fix the uh, butt loop issue, so you will be able to restart your phone, to turn it off, to actually let the battery drain, and it won't uh, make that, uh, that kernel panic. So I really hope this helps you guys, and I really hope you'll fix your device if you are um, one of the lucky person having um, still having iOS 9.1. So enjoy your jailbreak and till the next time, don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'm gonna catch you up in the next video. Goodbye.